Okay, hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to be showing you how to make a Nazi zombie map from start to finish. Uh, there are some tutorials out there like this, but none that I've seen that actually show you how to get Nazi zombie mode working, which is what I'm going to be showing you in this video. I'm going to try to finish the series sometime this week as it's been really busy with like lacrosse and school and stuff. So just be patient, and in this episode I'm going to be showing you how to set up your map and actually turn it into a Nazi zombie map. So first of all, you're going to want to go ahead and download the mod tools. Let me go ahead and get a link for you. You want to go ahead and go over to customcod.com, go to downloads, COD World at War map mod tools. And here you will download the version 1. You should also download the version 1.1, 1 1.2, and all of these. And what you're going to want to do is that when you download it, you're going to want to go to your, your World at War folder under your C drive, Program Files, Times 86, Activision, Call of Duty, World at War, and just drag everything from the RAW, raw file, I mean the RAR file into here and then you can want to do that in the same order for all of these versions then that's all installed once you've done all of that and just uh, replace everything if it asks you to replace it just replace it but you want to make sure that you're doing it in the order from one to four I believe yeah from one to four so after you've done that go to your bin in your Call of Duty World at War folder go to bin and find launcher. Go ahead and create a shortcut like I have right here and go ahead and open it up and drag it to your desktop. It will look like this. Um, if it doesn't then it's probably just asking you where your World at War folder is. So just type that in where it is and then you should come to this little screen right here. You won't have all these maps that I have right here but you will have some so what you want to go and do is go to create map single player and type in nazi underscore zombie underscore i'm just gonna put um i don't know three four five because you can only have three letters after this but i'll show you how to have how to have a full name later in the episode so just type in some random three letter thing after Nazi underscore zombie. So as you can see it is right there. And what you're going to want to go ahead and do is go over to Call of Duty World at War. And go to Raw. Maps. And go ahead and scroll down. And find. where um, You're going to want to find your Nazi underscore zombie map name gsc file okay so go ahead and double click on it open it up with notepad as you can see right here here's all the code this is not coded for zombies so what i'm going to show you is how to change that just go ahead and rename this to whatever you want only this gsc file oh come on i'm just going to name this um cynical underscore grunt so there we go we can go ahead and minimize this we're gonna go ahead and open up the script placer made by Mr. Hanky. I have a link right here and now what you want to go and do is go to script placer uh, do prototype for now that just means it doesn't have any power or perks or any of that and type in your map name uh, don't do already mapped because it's not mapped yet. We will come back to that later once it's already mapped. And just do check for existing files. That one showed up. So we're going to generate it. Overwrite. And if we check for exist existing files, it already created all of them for us. So now Nazi zombie, Nazi zombies will work. And what we're going to want to go and do is open up Radiant. Alright, just go ahead and 
let this load. My computer's being a little slow right now. Um, go to File, Open, find that map. As you can see, we have all this stuff here. We don't want this. So just go and click I on your keyboard and backspace. So you can see everything's deleted but our skybox. If you want a new skybox, I believe you go to um Yeah, see I'm not sure. I'll I forget where it is, but I'll show you guys later if you want a different skybox than this. So what we're gonna want to go and do is go to file, save as, and save this as our map name. So there we go. We can go ahead and save it. And if you can see, we can go and open it. It's right there. It is also over here in our little launcher thing. Go and delete that. And now we have our map, cynical underscore grunt.